Hello there, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa Armel with the Stock Swoosh, and I'm here reviewing the Stock Swoosh 2018 Trade Room Tracking. We'll go over here. If you have any questions, you can feel free to call me at 929-3200-GAP or email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. Remember, this is about empowering yourself to trade the market. You, you alone can do it. When you come to me, if you do my Golden Gap course, you will be eligible to join the live training room and receive all of these calls, but you learn everything in the class. I don't hold anything back that you could do to trade by yourself. So going back here, start off to the year, January 4th, LB was a winner, 5th, BKS was a winner, 8th, Play was a winner, DKS was a loser, Urban was a loser, AYI was a winner. One thing you'll notice is many of the days, it's only one ticker symbol, one trade, uh, we usually, if I start out and there's a loser at the beginning of the morning, I, I do a second gap. But in an ideal world, you only have one trade, one play a day with size. And that's the way to do it. It's the focus. January 10th, SVU was a winner. The 11th, no trades. GME was a winner on the 12th. Room close on the 15th. 16th, SPY was a winner. IBM was a winner. No trades on the 18th. Nike was a winner on the 19th. January 26th. SANM was a winner, 23rd No Trades, UAL was a winner, NWL was a winner, INTC was a winner on the 26th, really was a good start to the year. 29th, Sohu was a winner, Met was a winner, Juniper was a winner, eBay was a winner, Apple was a winner to start out February. And then some days there's no trades because there's nothing that meets my criteria. Uh, again, part of the focus. February 5th, No Trades, SWKS winner, CMG was a winner, that was a good one. Uh, February 8th, Tiva was a loser, HBI was a winner. 9th, EXP was a loser, EXP was a winner, there was two in that one. 12th, no trades. Monday's probably the slowest day of the week, actually. 13th, room closed. 14th, Spine was a loser, Car was a loser, Frossel was a winner. NTOT was a winner on the 15th, 16th, True was a winner. 19th, room closed. 20th, WMT was a loser, and a winner, two in that one. 221 SLCA was a winner, 222 AOI was a winner, HP was a winner on the 23rd, 26 DF was a winner, SPY was a winner, Dizzy was a winner on the 27th, 28th LOW was a loser, TSR was a loser, and CLG was a winner. MNST was a winner, start out March, March was a very good month. Foot Locker winner on the 2nd, 5th no trains, 6th Target was a winner, 7th DLTR was a winner, SPY was a winner on the 8th. Big was a winner, and QQQs was a winner on the 9th. 312, no trade. Spy was a loser on the 13th. QCOM was a loser. GE was a winner. It's been a great short for a while. SIG was a winner on the 14th. BABA was a winner on the 15th. 16th TIP was a winner. Facebook was a winner on the 19th. Oracle was a loser. Facebook was a winner on the 20th. Facebook was a big gap of the month. 321, love was a winner. 322, TB day off. And 323, QQQs was a loser. And WDC was a winner. So 61 trade calls, only 13 losers. Only 13. Only 13 from January, February, March. That's fantastic. And 48 winners. So win ratio of almost 80%, 79%. If you want to learn my method, how I figure out all these picks, how I find the picks, how I take the entries, I teach a class, it's online, it's a full two-day course on how to strategically find, pick, and play stocks that are professional bearish gaps. Class is online, you can be anywhere in the world and take it. Class tuition is $54.99, dates are April 14th and 15th, 9 to 5, that's the class for April, and it is a professional bearish gap system. If you're interested, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com if you want to sign up. It's going to be a great second quarter for 2018 looking to continue all the great calls and very excited about the rest of this year for many many reasons